G'day guys, I'm Biggest Kev, welcome to my channel. Today, I've received some material, I've got a, oh, about a bit less than half a bucket here, of, um, of material that a mate sent, or oh, he brought around actually and gave it to me. It's from Coolgardie in Western Australia, from the gold fields. And it's material that he's dug out of a creek. And he he hasn't panned any of it. He just he, he brought it home. He didn't want to deal with it. So he gave it to me to, to process. And the creek, apparently um, there is gold in that creek. So yeah, so he's given it, um, his name's Randy, a mate of mine. And uh, yeah, he's kindly given it to me to process. So we'll, we'll pan it out guys and see what we get. Okay. Oh dear. Okay, I'll just set yous up and I'll be I'll be right back. Okay. Pan number one of the Coolgardie material. Very, very rusty red. Typical of the Australian outback soil. Really rusty, oxidised material. Yeah, and um, I don't know where this, uh, what the creek's name is, where he got this material from. Um, yeah, all I know is he he brought it back from Coolgardie in Western Australia, and uh, yeah, and all he knows is the guy that put him onto the spot said that that he had found gold in this particular creek. So it's a gold bearing creek, so yeah, you never know. We'll see, see how we go. And I don't think they were panning for the gold there because it was a dry creek. I think they were just um, using metal detectors. So there's a good chance I might be able to get some fine gold out of this material. Okay guys, let's have a look, I'll pan this one back, it's early, uh, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning at the moment here, so that's why there's a bit of a shadow, the sun hasn't come right up yet, I can see some gold, and it's good gold too guys, it's, it's good gold, and this is just the first, um, you can see all the iron, pebbles in there or the ironstone and see all the gold at the back of the pan here I don't know if you can see it in the camera but um, there's plenty of fine gold heaps of it there's a piece of gold right there I hope you can see that so I'll have to go and get my snuffer bottle and I'll snuffer all this gold up and then because I've still got quite a bit of material there to, to go through there's one big big speck there, you'll be able to see that I reckon just in front of my finger there, in front of that shadow a nice speck and then all along the back of the pan is fine gold, yeah, well that's cool thank you very much Randy, cheers buddy I'll get back to you guys with another pan okay, this is pan number three guys and um, yeah, I've got gold in pan number two so gold in pan number one, number two uh, just fine gold, but that's all right. It's gold, and uh, and stay tuned um, for the end of the show, guys, for the wrap up because I'm doing a giveaway, and uh, I think you might all be um, excited about it, and I think you will all leave a comment and have a go at it because it's uh, the giveaway is. That I'm giving away is, is pretty special. Okay, let's see if we can get some more gold out of this pan. I think we will. I think there's going to be gold all through this material. I'll have to get Randy to go back and go and dig some more dirt out of this creek. Because, um, as I said, it's just a dry creek and uh, you only get water in there, in the, you know, when it rains. 
It's the only time you'll get water in, the, in that creek, apparently. So if they were getting nuggets there, um, yeah, there's obviously fine gold there. Oh, what have I done here? Come back. Okay. Sun's come up a bit more now, so you better see a bit better. I'm seeing gold already at the back of the pan. It's a bit hard to pan the back because of all this this iron, all this ironstone. Yeah, and apparently Randy said he he um, he dug down in the creek and he dug down until he hit the hit the um, the bedrock or the uh, it was compacted gravels in the bottom of the creek and this is where he took the sample from. And I hope you can see that, guys. I hope you can see all that all that fine specks of gold in the pan there. And all through this black sand here, I can see specks of gold. So I'm going to put some clean water in there and stuff all that up. Okay, I'll get back to this with the next pan. Okay, pan number five, guys. Gold in every pan. Yeah, just fine gold, but it's all right. It's some of the specks uh, you can easily see in the pan. Most of it's that really fine gold, but there's a lot of it. Um, yeah, a lot of fine little specks. You can easily see it in the pan. Cool. And um, I'll be going back to to the Rocky Creek, um, hopefully next week, guys. I'll, the weather's been good so far. The last three or four days have been good, but I've, I hurt my back, so I, I didn't want to go out there and, and try and do any shoveling and that, and lifting rocks and all that sort of thing. Um, my back's on the men now. It's getting a bit better, so I'll, um, I'll try and sneak out there next, next week, and I'll lift some rocks and dig down to the bedrock and see how we go, see if I can get some good gold out of that creek. Okay. I think I just saw a bit of gold then on the lip. Rightio. Yeah, there is a bit of gold up the back of the pan, I think. I think I just saw a speck, or maybe not. Yeah, it's all fine, fine gold, I can see it now. Probably a bit hard to see with this muddy water. But all in there, in that black sand up the back there, it's all super fine gold. Okay guys, I'll get back to this with another pan. Okay, pan number seven. The dirt is getting, the uh, water's getting a bit dirty now, I might even change it. Oh, I'll see how it goes. I've only got enough there for another, probably another two or three pans. So I might just carry on with this dirty water. What I'll do is I'll, um, when I get to the bottom of the pan, where the gold is, I'll, uh, I'll just tip in a bit of clean water. That'll be the go.
Okay guys, a bit of clean water so you can see the action. You can see what's going on. Okay, that's better. That's better, now you can see what's happening. Instead of all that dirty water. all that fine gold that's super fine this pan see it all guys all up in the back of the pan there all that super fine gold yeah okay I'll see you on the next pan look at the gold in this pan guys this is the pan I just did see up in here up in this corner here Hope you can see them all, see all those specks of gold. Yeah, some couple of nice bigger pieces there. Okay, I'll get on to the next pan. Okay, pan number 10. And I've got enough in the bucket for one more pan. Okay, yeah, this is good material. Um, thanks, thanks again, Randy. This is uh, good stuff, mate. Worthwhile going back and uh, and digging a bit more of this material. And that that's like with any of you guys that are going out prospecting. If you're getting nuggets, especially in a creek and a wash or something, and you're get picking up nuggets there's a chance there's going to be fine gold in that uh, dirt that you're digging. Okay, want to see some gold guys, check this out, gold in every pan. Oh, not as good as the last one, what's going on here guys? That last pan was, had some really good gold in it. Just super fine stuff at the back here. Not a real good one to show you. Okay, I'll get back with the last one. I'm going to rinse out the bucket and uh, we'll see what we get. Okay, pan number 11, I think this one is. Pan number 11 and the last one. I just rinsed out the bucket and I'll clean that bucket out thoroughly, guys, thoroughly. So I, when I use it again, if I go out the hills or whatever, and I'll use that, that bucket. But there's no contaminants in the bucket. I'm right onto that now. And uh, as I said before, hang around to the for the wrap up. I'm giving away something super. Okay. Okay, guys. 
last pan, maybe it holds some, maybe this pan holds some real big stuff. The bottom of the pan. Might be some nuggets in the bottom. Righty -o. Let's have a look, see if we can get a big piece. The dregs of the of the bucket. Look at all that iron stone. I've still got a bucket. Oh, look at that big piece. Yeah. I've still got a bucket there with all the oversize in. Um, there's still some clay balls and and rocks and stuff in there, so I'll uh, there's a nice piece, guys. See him? Right there. Yeah, that oversize I'm gonna I'll um rinse that out, put some water and then let it soak so the clay balls will all break down and then I'll uh, I'll pay, I'll pan that out. Not in this video, I'll do it another time. Yeah. But there's your gold, a few little specks here and there guys. Okay. Um I'll put it all I'll empty the stuff a bottle out and I'll just show you what I got. I'll be back. Okay guys. There's all the gold. Some of it's all mixed in with that black sand in there. But I hope you can see that. I can't really get it in too 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 close. I'll have to take some photos. And I'll um I'll run the microscope over it and just show you all the gold and you'll be able to see if it's jagged or smooth. Yeah. Okay guys, I'll see you at the wrap up for the giveaway. G'day guys. Okay. Now, that was cool. The gold that I just got, um, that Randy sent me from Coolgardie. Sorry about the dogs. Yeah. Um, yeah, thank you very much Randy, I appreciate it mate. Um, you digging that dirt out of that creek for me and, and bringing it back. Yeah, that's that was really good of you. Um, okay, so I'll put some pictures up guys of that gold. Now, the competition, I'm giving away a meteorite. There it is, I'll give you a close up. Now, this is one of the meteorites that was sent to me by Colin, and I'll put Colin's link up here for his channel. He was, um, very gracious. Yeah, anyway, he was very kind and gracious to send me eight meteorites he sent me, eight of them. So, I'm going to be giving them away. Yeah, so this one here I'm going to give away. All you've got to do is guess the way. There it is there. That's in my fingers. So just remember guys, these meteorites are heavier than what they look. So if you want to win this meteorite, in the comments just leave the weight. Just a minute, I've just got to go and kill one of these dogs. <laughs> yeah, so just guess the weight, guys. And, um, and it's, yeah, if you guess, if you're correct, it's yours. Yeah, cool. You can see the little flashes, little sparkly bits on there. Okay, that's it. I'll, I'll cut this short. These dogs are starting to go mental. And, um, Thanks for watching my videos. Thanks for subscribing and su supporting my channel. I appreciate you all. Take care out there, guys. Stay safe. And I'll see you on the next one. Good luck, guys.